the importance of realistic or up-to-date statistics. Obviously, if statistics are out of date, say by a year, six months, two days, then any SQL code which is looking at a database which has changed substantially since the last collection of statistics was executed, then that realistic picture of the database is somewhat skewed and possibly extremely skewed. As we've already seen, the CBO uses statistics. I refer to cost-based optimization as the CBO or CBO method of optimization. CBO gets an exact picture of data. One thing you can do in terms of the importance of realistic statistics is when testing and developing you can duplicate sets of statistics from the production database across to test and development databases. What this means is that assuming that you have a production database that you can use with a realistic set of statistics is that you can actually develop and test recent changes to your applications based on an actual picture of a production environment. It is quite typical that in development environments, particularly when obviously production environment doesn't exist, that development of SQL code and the performance of that SQL code is essentially tested on data created by developers. This is quite often not a realistic picture of what the database is going to look like when it's actually in use and in production. Another thing we need to remember is there are a large number of recent enhancements that require cost-based optimization. We'll go through those shortly in this chapter. And once again, rule-based optimization, which does not use statistics, is highly inefficient. It effectively guesses at a real picture of data based on a set of predefined rules created by the Oracle software, essentially the Oracle developers. The SQL Code Optimizer utilizes statistics to compile the most efficient methods of executing SQL statements. Statistics are measurements of the data itself, as I already said, such as how large a table is and how useful an index is. When a SQL statement accesses a table, particularly in OLTP databases with small transactions, the states of both tables and indexes are important in relation to statistics. They have to be up to date, they have to be realistic. It's absolutely essential to keep statistics out of date in order for the optimizer to perform at optimal performance capacity. It's also important to remember that out of date statistics have the same effect on any database that uses statistics to gain a precise picture of data. The other point about duplicating statistics from a production database or across different databases and environments for obviously the same schemas, the same sets of tables and indexes, is that you can actually copy sets of statistics without copying the data. In other words, if a production environment has millions and millions of rows, you don't have to copy the entire database. You can simply copy the statistics sets in order to test the optimization of SQL code within your development and testing environments. The DBMS stats package can be used for this particular purpose.